How much is the onion bag? $20. It's $35 outside, so yeah. <laughs> much cheaper. So, Kumra, uh, cabbage, cucumber. Yep. Yeah, we got uh, yellow potatoes. Yep, and how much is that nice. yellow potato bag? Yellow potato is $12 now. Only. That's very cheap. Yeah, good. It's cheap. $12. And this is and all... If you buy the whole bag of carrot, 20 kilos, $20. Yeah. And this is all fresh from farm? This is from farm. From farm, yeah. Yeah, cooking cover. Oh, good, good. And these are new new onions, this isn't it? This is a new season. New onions. You can see. Yeah. Good morning and welcome to another video of life in New Zealand. We have come to Avondale Farmers Market. Time is 6 a.m. Found our first shop here. They are actually selling uh, live plants. Looks like tulsi, some sort of herb. Nice and fresh. And these are chilies. Yeah, so it's a chilly season. When the summer hits, uh, obviously you can grow a lot of vegetables. This is some fresh basil. Just take it and uh, either plant in your garden or use as it is. I think that is turmeric plant not too sure but lots to explore let's carry on uh, some again some herbs uh, definitely this is mint and basil excuse me if i obviously don't tell the right name but um, yeah that was some mari marigold flowers yeah. okay mandarin the best fruit that you can have in new zealand <laughs> of course after kiwi but these are nice and sweet uh, no seeds and easy to eat uh, fresh and uh, I think refreshing for a quick snack let's explore not many vendors have actually opened the shop so still setting the shop it generally gets pretty crowded after 7 a.m you literally cannot even walk and you have to i guess walk through and push through the crowds to go from one side to another these are succulents low maintenance i actually have bought these three to five years back i think and uh, yeah i do have a large variety of collection with the kids hardly get any time to look after the plants or garden these days let's explore keep going on uh, let's go and find actually the vegetable section so that i can give you a quick snake peek. Okay, pass through a few uh, old tools area of the vendors. Now these are jumbo strawberries. It says $15 a kg. But if you haven't tried this, I do recommend give it a go. The bigger strawberries, the tastier and sweeter they are. It's a little pricier, but it'll obviously come down go December. Some blueberries as well. Uh, big punnet, that is good. And these are gold kiwi fruit. It says $20 box. Um, is it cheap? Probably yes, yeah, compared to supermarkets at this time of the year. Some Cumra apples, $2.99, definitely cheaper than supermarket and looks fresh as well from the farm. So yeah, well worth it. Um, more mandarins here, it says $4.99 a kg. It generally retails for about $6, so definitely a good, good buy. Ginger, most of the vegetables are cheaper here if you compare to the supermarket. Cheaper and fresher, I guess. Uh, garlic is $3.00. Let's see what else we find here. Uh, eggplant, $5.99, nice and shiny. These are the only ones you get very often here. Those small ones uh, generally, yeah, pretty hard to find. But uh, I think, um, I guess these are the ones available. Some chili plants. Um, this year I'm going to pass on the chili plants, but every year, if you just plant these uh, little uh, chili plants, they actually give you a good output of three months, which is good. Um, more more fruits and uh, mangoes yeah peeled onion 7.99 and uh, what do we have we uh, potato 1.99 some leafy vegetables how much are the onion bag 20 dollars nice. it's 35 outside so yeah. <laughs> much cheaper has got a lot of onions and fresh vegetables okay, right from the farm. <laughs> you got carrot also? Uh, cabbage, cucumber. Yep. 
Yeah, we got a yellow potatoes. Yep. And it's how much is that nice. yellow potato bag? Yellow potato is twelve dollar now. Only. That's very cheap. Yeah. Good. It's yeah. cheap. And this is and all. If you buy the whole bag of carrot, twenty kilo, twenty yeah. dollars. And this is all fresh from farm. This is from farm. From farm, yeah. Yeah, cooking cover. Oh, good, good. And these are new, new onions. This is a new season. New, new season. You can see. Yeah. Very thin skin. And the red onion too, cheap, eight dollars. <coughs> oh, good. Five dollars. Six dollars cabbage. That one, right? Yeah. Three dollars. <laughs> Mango is for seven ninety nine. Let me get this got some kumara for one nine ninety nine. And the squash as well, for three ninety nine. And the ginger seven ninety nine. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Okay, let's move on. That was a friendly shopkeeper. Let's see what else do we have here. Cucumbers, Cucumbers all sizes. In supermarkets, generally, you get the good looking ones, but uh, yeah, I would prefer these ones because it's good to eat. So, no harm in obviously consuming those. Um, what else do we have here? Some beetle leaves, curry leaves, plant, and mint leaves. More plants here. I think that is lavender and some fresh flowers. Moving on, moving on. I have no clue what is this. Some sort of fruit or vegetable, I'm guessing. And this is honey. 100% um, kiwi New Zealand honey. Although, obviously, not branded, but uh, I guess uh, it is from some sort of farm. So good, support the locals. Let's go. As you can see, people are actually still setting up the shop and we will carry on. I actually haven't got any cash today. This is only a cash market. So yeah, if you are coming here, make sure you get some cash. Lemons, it's not a lemon season, but I guess you can see those are end of the season lemons and it's getting a bit more expensive. Uh, I think it's about seven, nine on eight dollars per kg. Three spicy ones. These are spicy. Spicy and non-spicy chili. I think these are good to make those fritters or you can call them budgie or budgias. Um, yeah, I didn't get any cash, so I'm not going to do any shopping today. Just a quick visit and then most likely Sunday. This only happens on a Sunday once a week. So if you're coming this side, yeah, get some cash, get, uh, get a lot of spare ba bags uh, so that you can obviously avoid taking plastic home. More fruits, bananas, more mandarins, a lot of mandarins actually, it's uh, season, so yeah, if you're in New Zealand, don't miss them. And let's take a walk, um, some radish, coriander, my favorite, looks really good and fresh, some uh, $2.99 potatoes, what else do we have here? Mm. Yeah, now it's repeating, but uh, let's, um, yeah, more lemons. Bananas, apples, more lemons, a lot of lemons. End of season, so I guess everyone wants to sell them through. Cauliflower actually went up to $15. Now it's, um, I think, affordable, I would say. A uh, lot of fresh spinach. Yeah, it doesn't look perfect, but this is the best one to actually use in your kitchen. And um, spring onions, yes. And a lot of coriander again. There is some broccoli, although. What else do we have here? Cauliflower, more carrots, red onions, potatoes. These are non-brushed ones, so you get uh, obviously washed and unwashed. Uh, personal choice, but I think I don't know if it actually makes a difference in taste. Yeah, hot chili plants. But yeah, I generally go with the white washed potato, just saves a bit of time. Organic herb NZ. Look at this shop, so cool. Locals, $5 Thai basil, and yeah. Totally support the local. What else do we have here? More chilies. Yeah, it's in totally in season because uh, generally summer you get a lot of chilies and uh, tomatoes and um, carrots is pretty much around the season. Uh, this is chives. Yeah, 
and uh, again some sort of herb not sure this is bitter gourd bitter gourd yeah karela good for uh, reducing sugar levels i've heard so that's good it doesn't taste good it's probably depending on the way you cook um, as you can see yeah it's already starting to build up a lot of vendors already have come up um, so if you come here generally um, on an average you end up spending about 50 to 60 dollars depending on what you purchase but my average bill is about 50 to 70 dollars and i at least take about three bags home and that lasts for more than two weeks generally what i've noticed is if i buy something from supermarket it generally goes off uh, within a week but this one actually stays fresh longer maybe because it hasn't been in the chiller for too long or um, straight from the farm yeah all sort of reasons um what else do we have here some chili some cucumber uh, people already queuing up there is some um, food fresh food home cooked food i think um, asian meals i haven't tried but i think i did try uh, steam buns that was really good you know what do we have here soy sauce flavored pressed tofu marinated fish soya milk uh, looks pretty fresh smells good too mandarin yes again mandarin and uh, look let's uh, take a walk around and uh, i think finish up the video i hope you enjoyed the video and uh, do leave a comment and do subscribe if you like my channel watch out for more content have a great sunday and have a wonderful awesome day bye for not bringing cash. I have to beat myself for not bringing cash.